All right, White Hawks, welcome to workout number three. We're going to start off with sports sprints for, for 30 seconds. We're going to jog in place with high knees. Ready? Here we go. Here we go. High knees. And here we go again. It wasn't fair that I was making you guys do all these exercises and I wasn't doing it. I was reusing the previous day's exercises. All right, 10 seconds. Here we go, double time. Five, four, three, two, one. Good job, White Hawks. All right, next one. Diagonal lunges. Oh, this one's really easy. You basically are gonna do a lunge Cross your legs and do a lunge. You could do a reverse lunge, but hit the start button. All right, here we go. Cross your legs and do a lunge. Oops, cross your legs and do a lunge. Diagonal lunges. See how far down you can go. I'm pretty old, so I can't go too down. Too far or I won't be able to get back up. All right, 15 more seconds. Good. Five seconds, here we go. Four, three, two, last one, one, good. Next one, primal step ups. All right, we did this one before. This one should be easy for us. All right, start in the stand up position. You're gonna do a reverse lunge, get into the runner's position, and then this back up. Switch legs, runner's position, back up. Runner's position, Back up, I wish I had weights in my hand. If I had weights in your hands, this would be a little bit more work, a little bit harder to do. So runner's position, back to start. 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 There's the timer. Oh, stop. All right. Next one, bicycles, bicycles, and start. All right, fast bicycles. Oh boy! All right. <laughs> Opposites. Bring your right knee to your left elbow. Left elbow to your right knee. Have your head off the ground. So you're getting a little bit of a crunch out of it. Working your abs. Time. <laughs> All right. Whew. Next one. Agility circles. I'm gonna use my wimpy kid book. I'm gonna put that on the ground as my reference. All right. All right, for 30 seconds, I'm gonna run around the, the book, switch directions, but keep facing forward the whole time that I'm doing it. So see how fast you guys can do this without crossing, without crossing your legs. Ten more seconds. Keep going, guys. Last time. All right, next one. Oh, the hardest one. I'm not looking forward to this one. The dive bombers, we did this the other day. So, dive bombers. You're gonna have your seat up in the air, really high push up. And you're gonna go down, like you're going underneath the fence, and then back up. Have your seat high in the air, go down, right back up. All right, do two more of those please, dive bombers. So you go all the way down and curl your back and come back up. I might not have been the best example of that. All right, finish that last one. Good job, White Hawks. Whew. Next one, surfers. I'm gonna use a line on the floor. I use a line on the floor, it's a little bit easier for me. All right, pretend like you're surfing. 
you're on a board, and then you quickly jump up like you're riding on your wave. Dun, dun, dun. Again, down in a push-up position, pop myself up as quickly as I can, and be a surfer, surfer dude, surfer dude. All right, do one more, please. Lay on the ground like you're on the surfboard, and then pop up as fast as you can. Good job. Next one. Next one. These are called jump lunges. All right, I'll demonstrate. You're gonna step with one leg. In this case, I'm gonna start with step with my left. I'm gonna step with my left, do a lunge, and then as I leap, I'm gonna land on my opposite foot. All right, it's kind of easy if you think about basketball. So if I'm doing a right-handed layup, I'm gonna step with my left and leap with my right, like so. Now, if I switch it, go the other way. My right knee, uh, my right leg is out, my left knee is down, and then I land on my left. One more time with that one. That wasn't very good. Right, land on my left. All right, 30 seconds. Here we go. Here we go again. All right, good. All right, lunge, jump. Lunge, jump. Lunge, it's way easier for me to do it on one side than it is for the other side, isn't it? I'm really used to doing right handed layups. One more. No, one more. Left side. My weak side. All right. This is your uh, step up squat. So you're going to do your, just like you did the primal step up, you're going to do a runner's position, but now you're going to go into a squat and then you're going to do a, a jump. All right. 30 seconds. Here we go. All right. Runner's position, squat, jump. Switch legs, runner's position. Squat, jump, runner's position, squat, jump. Switch legs, runner's position, squat, jump. Good, runner's position, squat, jump. Runner's position, squat, jump. Runner's position, squat, jump. Runner's position, squat, jump. Well, I got one more after this one. Good job, Whitehawks. All right, last one we're going to do is our T-stands, or they call it push-up, um, and rotates. All right, here we go. And start. Start. Oh. All right, T-stands, here we go. Push-up position, stay on one side. Hold it there for a few bit, a few seconds, switch. Switch. Now make this hard for yourself. Do a push up in between. It's been a long day. Switch. All right, White Hawks, you get the idea? Finish that last one. Good job, White Hawks. We did it. All done for the day.